What's going on guys, Scriptures here, and today we're going to be playing Rise of the Tomb Raider. This is a game that's been sitting on my computer for God knows how long. <clears throat> I haven't been playing anything other than Elder Scrolls lately, and uh, it's mainly because I am super addicted to that game. But I have to take a break, unfortunately, because the internet isn't working. And we have to wait at least a week until we all get paid till we can get the damn uh, internet back on. But until then... I'm going to be playing some uh, Tomb Raider, and there's some other games I haven't played in, in a really long time that I, I want to get back on. So, we shall do that very soon, and uh, yeah, let's start a new game. What makes someone reach beyond the boundaries of human experience to face the unknown? As children, we question the world around us. We learn, we accept and gradually we lose our capacity for wonder. But some do not. The explorers, the seekers of truth. It is these pioneers who define the future of mankind. The others, they're done. No amount of money is going to get him through those mountains. The lost city's up there, somewhere. That's going to be a hell of a climb. I'm not turning back. I know. You should stay here with them. Not a chance. There. Wait till you see this view, Lara. Take my hand. Thanks. Look at that. It's amazing. But the snow coming off those peaks is a bad sign. Oh, okay. I Try forgot I could play now. Mountain. We'll have a good view of the valley beyond from the summit. All right. Let's take it easy here. This game has a lot of, like, quick time events and cutscenes and stuff. Just need and it's kind of hard to get used to because uh, I'm not used to this type of gameplay. Hey, I'm used to actually just playing the game, so... It takes some getting wrong. used to with this whole system and how this is. It feels like you're playing a Michael Bay game. <laughs> Not that there's anything wrong with a Michael Bay movie, but uh, uh yeah, actually there is. Oh shit. Shit. You okay? Lost my footing. I'm fine. Yeah, I'll take that back. That last Transformers was terrible. I want to go up. Uh, all right. Okay, so you have to completely stop before, then you jump, then you jump. There we go. Good job. No, it's too dangerous. I can climb back up. Oh God, this is the new way of climbing. Can jump over that. There we go. There's those gymnastic skills. Oh bullshit. Oh, I'm still alive. Oh shit. This is how you climb. This is how real climbers climb. Shit, 
Lara, you're gonna give me a heart attack. Are you okay? Yeah. Come on. Looks like we gotta go through. I really like the graphics in this game. They did a really good job with this. Storm's getting closer. We have a couple hours at most. Should be enough time. We're almost to the top. What do you think? We're close to something, Jonah. I can feel it. Just his last stretch to the top. All right. She doesn't look like Angelina Jolie anymore. She's like a typical white girl. Feels pretty solid, but keep close to the wall. Okay. Oh, I'm supposed to play now? Okay. Looks like we climb from here. Keep your eyes open for falling ice. Right. <laughs> Let's do the climb. I love climbing like this. I feel like it's faster too. Oh my god, that looks so fucking crazy. Sometimes the game doesn't really let you know if it's still a movie or if it's the actual gameplay. Like right now, it's movie. So it, it kind of confuses you sometimes. Jonah, we made it. I see the ruins. Oh God. Actually, I haven't even been completely far into this game yet. Like, I've only gotten to the part where there's like a bear you gotta fight. And that was it. So that's pretty much like the very beginning of the game. How the hell? Come on. There. Oh. Gotta make it more dramatic. All right. Yeah, especially with her swinging around like a fucking monkey. Let's get back to climbing. Run. 
running like a child. Brothers. Okay. I really hate when games and movies do this crap. I wish they would have showed this first and then got to that part. But no. They have to show the future first and then go to the past. It is the greatest cruelty of life that we're all too swiftly taken from it. We age, we decay, we die. What do we leave behind? Bones? Dust? What of the soul? Does it endure beyond our earthly existence? I believe it does. A truth lies at the heart of many myths and stories. A truth not of science, but something more profound. The key to unlocking everlasting life. I may have found the next piece to the puzzle, but I'm not alone in this search. They're following me, watching my every step. I know them by name now. Trinity. An ancient, violent sect with designs on controlling the future of humanity. I must proceed carefully for the sake of my family. If anything were to ever happen to Lara or Anna, I could never forgive myself. doing here? I saw the gutter press was attacking you again. I thought you could use some company. No lies. Were you followed? Followed? Of course not. What's going on? I think I found the tomb. Oh, you can't be serious. The myth of the prophet is real. Dad was right. Lara, your father was unwell. No. He was close to a great discovery, tangible evidence of the immortal soul. I loved Richard. I would have married him if he'd asked. But he was a broken man. I don't want to see you end up like him. But Anna, he was right. It was everyone else who was wrong. Tombs in Syria. Syria? Oh, God, Laura, no. 
This is madness. Why is her eyes bloodshot red? Get your life sorted. Go home to the manor. You know I can't go back there. But this obsession ruined your father. I saw something. Something I... I can't explain. Now I understand what Dad was going through. It's all fairy tales. Nonsense. Don't go down this road. You know where it leads. It's the only thing that makes sense to me now. I'm going to find the prophets too. <laughs> You should have showed all this shit first. This is a lot more interesting than that whole mountain climbing. Hey, we're heading into a war zone now. We better be sure about this. We're close. There should be an oasis in the canyon just ahead. You're wasting your time. There's nothing out here. Just keep driving, please. It's your money. So they're already deep into the desert, and this guy is asking questions now. Something isn't right. Oh, that's just local militia. You told someone, didn't you? They they paid better than you. You <laughs> Shit! They weren't supposed to shoot at us. Get us out of here! Shit! Shit! Asshole got killed. How does she always have this thing on her all the time, this mountain climbing thing? jump like that. She was just in a lot of pain, by the way. Something's here. Could this really be it? healing miracles. Dad's notes mention this. Hmm. 
Oh, what was that? Seems to be a map of some sort, but I can't quite read the words. It's the prophet speaking with a foreign army. He convinced them to lay down their weapons. These are the miracles of the prophet of Constantinople, unjustly murdered by order of Trinity. Translate the monolith, so... Hmm. My Greek is still a little rusty, but it's pointing to something hidden nearby. I'll mark down the locations. Coins cash? Let's see what this is. Player beacon. I'm confused. Is this supposed to be an open world game or is this very instanced? Can't tell. But, um, alright, let's see what else we can find around here. Oh, ancient coins. Very nice. Oh, this is the way I came. Okay, let's go forward then. He led his followers through the desert, to the oasis. All right. Secret though. It's amazing. If only Dad Good thing it would have more this. security. And this is out in the world. Anybody could have flown a helicopter over this and seen this. The devil, I hear a helicopter right now. Oh, there it is. They're already here. Got to get inside. It only took them how many years? A thousand years? Finally. It feels like it was trying to be like Uncharted, and I mean, it's doing a pretty good job of that. Like, it feels like I'm playing Uncharted right now. The Order of Trinity Even though I haven't played Uncharted all the way through, it still until feels like that. Them in their hidden oasis. All right, let's go to the creepy tunnel. Creepy skeletons. Hey, at least it's scorpions and it's not roaches. Cause I would freak the fuck out of those roaches. Trinity has received word that the Prophet's followers are building a great tomb. 
at an oasis outside Berea. But more upsetting, while we thought they were building the tomb for their prophet, Trinity now believes he still lives. We have learned he is preaching his heresy among the local citizens, drawing more to him daily with his tales of how he conquered death. He is a liar. He is a liar. And a heretic, claiming miracles that come only from the divine. You swore he was dead. Have you failed us? Oh shit, calling the motherfucker out. Let's see what else we can find out here. Uh, kind of looks like they still have skin on. They're mummified. Okay, that's random. That was too close. Blasting their way in. <laughs> and of course, there's a safety thing up there. She could have been just trapped in here for the rest of her life. Let's hope this works. Again, another opening. See that crack up there? Somebody could have easily like repelled down instead of going through all this shit that she just went through. Okay, where can we go? Let's go jump down here. Thing. They're almost inside. My lord, what you say is impossible. I myself drove a spear into the prophet's heart. I saw him die. Doubtless his people have propped another man up in the slain prophet's robe to continue his lies. They are broken, they are broken. discredited, and exiled. We will head south and put the rest of his people to the sword. But the prophet is dead. This, I swear. This I swear. Bada bada poppy poppy. Yeah, 
Yeah, bon uh, boys to men song stuck in my head now. Run. Oh, this shit again. Bullshit. jump back up here, yes. There we go. Oh, what's this? Oh, more money. <laughs> I was like I was gonna go underneath it. Perfect. Obviously, somebody came here first. All these open holes and stuff. See, the way they came in, that was pro shit. It was empty when I got here. There was no body and definitely no artifact. Get shot while getting crushed.
come on, all these rocks hitting her in the face. That would hurt extremely bad. Alright, I'm going to end the video right here. Thanks for watching, guys. Hit that thumbs up if you liked it. Thumbs down if you didn't. And I'll see you in the next one. Laters.